Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install latest Fedora version that is Fedora 37 on VirtualBox. Go to Fedora official website that is get fedora.org. I will keep this link in the video description. See the note here Fedora 37 released. Today only it has released. We have two types of Fedora, workstation and server. In this video, I am going to show you how to install Fedora workstation on VirtualBox. The installation process on VirtualBox is same for both workstation and server. Click on download. Here we have three images. Fedora x80 fedora 37 x86 live and arc arc live iso arc raw image we are going to download this live iso then click on download it won't ask any registration see download has been started click on show all see its size is 1.9 gigabytes i am cancelling this download because i have already downloaded the fedora workstation live in your case, wait until download completes. Once download is completed, then open VirtualBox. If you haven't installed VirtualBox, then go through the link provided in the video description and install VirtualBox. See, I have these many virtual machines in my VirtualBox. Now we have to create new virtual machine for Fedora 37. Click on new or machine and select new. Provide name as Fedora 37. This is the virtual machine folder location. Type is Linux. Version is Fedora 64. This is memory size. I am increasing memory size to 4 gigabytes. If you have more memory, then you can provide anything. But minimum required is 1024 megabytes that is 1 gigabytes hard disk create a virtual hard disk now then click on create this is the virtual hard disk file location i am increasing the file size to 40 gigabytes then hard disk file type virtual hard disk then storage i am set i am going with dynamically allocated then click on Create. We have created a virtual machine, but we haven't mounted the downloaded ISO file. Click on settings, then storage, then click on this control IDE, then click on this drop down button, choose a disk file, or simply click on this empty, then choose a disk file, then select the downloaded Fedora ISO file. Click on open. See, file has been mounted. Now click on the start button to start the actual installation of Fedora 37. Use the up and down arrows from your keyboard. Select the first option that is Fedora Workstation Live 37 and press enter. If cursor is disabled, then press right control button from your keyboard. Then cursor will be released. See. See, here we have two options. One drive Fedora and another one install to hard drive. Drive Fedora is temporary purpose. If you want to install permanently then click on this install to hard drive select this one and click on this install to hard drive now 
Then select the language. Then click on continue. See here, begin installation has been grayed out. Why? Because we have to fill this, this red color items. Click on this installation destination. I am going with default installation destination. Click on done. Now this will be enabled. See, now we are able to click this begin installation. Click on it. See, installation has been completed. Click on finish installation. What I have done? I have shut down and started. Not the reboot. Click on start setup. Click on next. If you want to enable third party repositories, then you have to click on this enable third party repositories. Then click on next. Skip this online accounts. We have to create a user. I am giving full name as R2 schools and username also same. Click on next. Provide the password for this R2 schools user. Then click on next. Setup completed. Click on start using Fedora Linux. This is the Fedora Linux desktop screen. Click on activities. Then search for terminal. Let's verify Fedora Linux information. More slash etc os hyphen release. Name is Fedora and version is 37. It is workstation edition. So in this video we have seen how to download and install Fedora Linux 37 on VirtualBox. In the next video we will see how to do the same in VMware workstation. For more videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.